Double HD Nation stand up and welcome back to the channel today we are kicking off truck week on the channel I am so excited oh my gosh so up first Monday we will be doing what you are watching right now this awesome unboxing of the new 2020 Hot, uh, Hot Wheels monster trucks I got 32 of them so we're gonna open them we got two packs we got singles then we also have the new ones that come with a free Hot Wheel car. So I cannot wait to dive into these. So this is probably going to be a fairly long video. So uh, batten down the hatches. But then also we will have the Monster Truck King of the Hill. Where our current King Hot Wheels Racing number three. Number three will uh, defend his crown. So uh, awesome. And we will also have, as you guys saw in the little intro to this video... I am getting ready to unveil a brand new fat track setup so uh that will be replacing the 164 wars so uh get ready for fat track thursdays on the channel and this week kicking off fat track thursday for the annual event we will have our hot wheels trucks and we will have uh tow trucks tahoes uh custom el caminos all that kind of fun stuff so uh definitely look forward to that and we will also have a hot wheels basic king of the hill truck challenge as well as a monstrosity yes the monstrosity is back this weekend and it will be featuring the hot wheels trucks so without further oh before we continue on okay so we're about a minute 40 into this so uh, hopefully you guys have stayed around for this long but for the joey logano giveaway make sure you head over to the community tab that is where i will have all the rules on how you can enter that giveaway so uh don't worry it's still happening but i'm not gonna make a separate video for it it will just be in the community tab so without further ado let's go ahead and break open some 2020 hot wheels monster trucks all right so starting off first oh yeah no no not you not you starting off first you have the oscar meyer wiener mobile very cool new for 2020 now a lot of these don't say new for 2020 on them. Uh, some of them just have the copyright date of 2019. So some of them may be 2019, but you know, most of these are 2020 trucks. So that's what the title will be captioned as. You guys can go ahead and look at his stats there. I'm not going to read everything, do you? But uh, the hottest dog, that's pretty, pretty funny. Wiener roast. <laughs> Grill the competition. All right. That's, uh, that's, uh, that's enough funny business. All right giant wheels of course it does come with a crush car blue yeah we'll go ahead and take a look at the wiener mobile let me scoot up a little bit oh yeah looks like his looks like it's been bitten out of the bun got a little smiley face of course you have the ketchup and mustard there on the side i've actually seen the wiener mobile in person before it's uh kind of underwhelming yeah, there you go. Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. All right. Ooh, let's go with, uh, how about you? Here we go. We have the Radical Racer. Very cool. New for 2020. Includes a crushable car. Love the green bead locks on this. Also kind of like the, that's supposed to be like slime or saliva coming out of his mouth. I don't know. And look at stats on the back. You guys can go ahead and read that. Pause if you'd like. But just because we have so many to go over, we can. We don't have time to stop and say hello to everybody. And I dropped the crushable car. Comes with a red crushable car. I don't know what I did with the other one. Oh, there it is. Also, there will be a twist to this monster truck, King of the Hill. We're going to have a jump. <laughs> I know you guys are probably thinking, woohoo, jump. But it will, should be interesting. But here we go. This is Radical Racer. Love the green slime. Love the buck teeth. All I want for Christmas is my two front teeth. Of course, the exhaust looks like whiskers. Pretty awesome. Number 99. Hot Wheels monster trucks. They're all right there on the back. I like how this is kind of like an embossed decaling. That's pretty nice. Now, I know a lot of people really like the monster trucks from Spin Master, but I have to say, I think I'm more of a fan of the Hot Wheels monster trucks. I know I'll probably get crucified for saying that, but you know, that's 2020. If you have a different opinion, you're, you're automatically a bad guy. 
<laughs> all right, next up you have, this is all fried up. Definitely got a pickup scheme, new for 2020. Includes a crushable car. You guys can go look at the stats. Make sure you pause so you can read it. I like how the monster trucks are easy to open though, that's nice. Blue crushable car. And we'll take a look at all fried up. Oh yeah, definitely got the french fries. Of course, looking at that automatically automatically sends me back to Sausage Party. If you guys don't know what Sausage Party is, it's, a, it's an animated movie. Not for kids. And it is hilarious. Got french fries up there, which look like they're being torn in half from all the... This is, this is kind of morbid on here. <laughs> of course, you have the red wheels. Look pretty sharp, pretty sharp. All fried up on the tailgate. I love the red windshield, too. That's nice. All fried up. Right, next up, you have Bone Shaker, but it's not really Bone Shaker. This is from the Stunt Storm series. And as you guys see, it definitely, definitely has a sick paint scheme on there. That looks amazing. I love it. All right. Look at back real quick. You always leave them rattled. Comes with a yellow crush car. Now we'll take a look at this sweet ass bone shaker. This thing is awesome. Wow. Bone shaker right there on the, look at the ghouls. That is just sick, you guys. Bone shaker. I still think they missed an opportunity calling this monster shaker. I don't know what happened there, but you know. Look at the top, look at that. That is sweet. All right, you got the ghoul bone shaker. I mean, they just call it bone shaker, but also love the orange beadlock. All right, next up we have the first of two. Got Hal Weiler. There is a red one in this pile someplace. Let's go ahead and look at the back. And I know this one doesn't say new for 2020, but copywritten in 2019. So, like I said, some of these may be from 2019, but the majority of them are from 2020. So, uh, this will be called a 2020 monster truck unboxing. Now, how how Weiler definitely has one of the sweetest castings. I love, love it. Love, love, love it. Love the chain on the back with his collar. Now on the Hot Wheels basic model, I believe his job goes up and down. Love the exhaust pipes right there. Man, this thing is sick. Hot Wheels monster truck logo there on the fender. Love the dark or the burnt orange uh, beadlock. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Hal Weiler. All right, <laughs> let's go with you. Here we go, the Hound Holler. All right, I look at the back. To make them all howl, man, Hot Wheels. You're getting a little nasty, You're getting a little nasty on us. Red crush car. A whole bunch of those here pretty soon. All right, hound hauler. Now this definitely has an interesting paint scheme. You go from yellow to green to turquoise. But let me tell you, the decos are sweet. Even though it's kind of sad seeing puppies in cages. Oh my God, I want to cry. But the dairy delivery is definitely my favorite style of monster truck. I love it. And I got my favorite one coming up here pretty soon. Well, I don't know how what when pretty soon is. We got a while. But Hound Hauler monster truck logo there on the back. Well, that puppy looks happy. Hound Hauler. Got the dog bone with the Hot Wheels sign and the padlock. Yeah, I gotta say this is kind of a sad truck. Yeah. Okay. Hound Hauler. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Next up, we have Operation Stomp. To always complete the mission. All right. 
Give me the monster truck. Comes with a turquoise crush car. All right, Operation Stomp. Definitely has the matte scheme on there. I love that. With the green window. Oh my god. Look at the chassis, too. All uh, kind of like an X Racer's body where it's see through. Green beadlock. I feel like the chassis is kind of falling down a little bit, though. I feel like this should be up higher, like where it is with the A-frame and the top post. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Operation Stomp on the back. Yeah. Love the mat. That is sick. Booyah! All right. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. We have Abysmal, another dairy delivery scheme to sink the other trucks. All right, very cool. Love the dairy delivery schemes. They're my favorite, why, I don't know. Crush car in green. But yes, Abysmal, this thing is sick. No, not my favorite, but it is quite beautiful if I do say so myself. Yeah, the orange wheels with the, the darker orange beadlock. You got the octopus on there. Very angry octopus, probably because his head's on fire. Abysmal. Abysmal. What do we got here? What does that say? Beware. Come on, focus. Beware. Beware the seven seas? Huh, okay. Abysmal. Man, this thing's sweet. Love the, the purple chassis, too. Beware the seven seas. Hmm. All right, I dig it. Abysmal. All right. Oh, my gosh. We got a lot of singles to go. Now here's one that is quite sought after, and I don't really know why, and it is the Camaro Monster Truck. I see people trying to scalp this for like 25, 30 bucks on eBay, I don't know why. I'm still after the VW Drag Bus, so if you guys have one, have an extra one, send me an email, I need it. <laughs> Turquoise Crush Car. And now you have the Camaro. Quite ugly, but meh, pretty nice. Get the burnt orange coloring, the Hot Wheels license plate. Now they could have done decals on the front and back. Oh, they did do it on the front. You can kind of see where the angel eyes are kind of painted right there. The bow ties painted. Okay, so I guess they just didn't do the back. That's all right. Hot Wheels logo right there. Just a pretty plain Jane monster truck, I say. Love the chrome wheels, it looks nice. But yeah, cannot wait to see how well it does with the King of the Hill challenge we got coming up. All right, next up we have Gutter Growler. Gutter Growler. New for 2020. Go ahead and look at the stats. And there went the crush car again. It's like the 14th one I've dropped. Orange. Orange crush car. And now we got Gutter Growler. Got a whole bunch of rats on there. Kind of kind of creepy. Got like a sewer lid right there. Hot Wheel City Sewer. Gutter Growler. Pretty interesting truck, I do say. Sewer maintenance. Again, the roll cage is definitely lower than the cab itself. I don't know if that's just how they put them together, but to me that seems off. I don't know. Oh, maybe maybe it's not, because you can see the driver's seat right there. Meh, okay. Love the green beadlock that matches the rest of the truck. I love it. Gutter growler. All right. Let me get the rest of the singles up here. Uh, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, we're all seven, three, 
nine singles left. Then we break into the two packs. All right, so next up we have Hall Y'all. So it's kind of like a ride along monster truck. Pretty sweet. Take a look at the stats back here. To get the fans front and center. Oh man. A crowded favorite. <laughs> oh look, I dropped another car. Another crushable car. Oh, don't tip over, you guys. All right. So here is Hall Y'all. Definitely a sweet looking ride along truck. The Hall Y'all got the yellow. No, that's clear. Sorry, I'm just blind. The, no, it is kind of like a yellow tint windshield. Nah, it's more like a gray. I don't know. It's a color. <laughs> got the yellow chassis with the eight seats in the back. Man, I would love to go on a ride along in a, in a monster truck. That'd be so cool. I love what they did here. The Hot Wheels in the grill. See, I wish they would have done that with like some of the other trucks. See, that would have been sweet. I like that. I like the little detailing like that. I wonder if Isle Driver would stand in there. I have to find out. Yeah, this thing is sweet. Definitely one of my favorite castings. And now we'll see how it does come race day. Stand there on top of your brothers. All right, like I said, it was one of two, and here is the second How Weiler. Definitely have the red scheme going on this time. Pretty much the stats are the same, just a different color. All right. Comes with a green crush car. Now I do like this one, but I have to say, I like that one better. This one is nice. Comes with number 68 on the side. The other one did not. The other one did not have a printed number on the side. No, don't play dead. Did not have a printed number on the side, nor on the hood. Number 68. I do like the burgundy color they went with. Wish they would have had eight exhausts instead of six. That's just me being a car fanatic. No way would this have six cylinders in there. This would definitely be a monstrous V8. But uh, again, that's just me. But yeah, there is the second Howweiler. All right, next up we're coming to one of the black and white series, and that is Chassis Snapper. I love the black and white series. That looks sick, in my opinion. So I think we're missing, yep, missing Piranha and will trash it all so hope i can find those soon it may not even be out yet because i know how these monster trucks like to come out in waves comes with an orange crush car and now we have chassis snapper with the black and white scheme definitely love it especially with the white wheels you got the now snapping turtles we have quite a bit of them in iowa and the, they are nothing to mess around with It'll take a finger right off. Not a finger. Chassis snapper. Of course, that was, those look like clams right there. But I think it's part of a shell design. That is exactly what it is. Chassis snapper. Very cool. Chassis snapper. Nah. Sorry about that. <laughs> Falling with the black and white trend, you have Mega Rex. Now, as we, if you guys recall from the first uh, Monster Truck King of the Hill we had, which was quite a while ago, Mega Rex was the only truck to spin out and take out the camera. So uh, if you guys haven't seen that video, I will link it. But yeah, Mega Rex. Comes with a yellow crush car. And it's basically just like a standard Mega Rex, but they just took the color away from him. But I like how they went with black wheels and the white beadlock. That looks really, really nice. Got his little tail. Got his little tail. Mega Rex. Definitely a sharp looking monster truck. Alright. Next up. Now this is a person I think is going to have 
the best luck going head to head with our current monster truck king and that is hot wheels racing number one these hot wheels racing trucks are fast and uh definitely cannot wait to see him take on the competition green crush car holy moly all right and here we are with hot wheels racing number one Definitely looks more of a souped up truck than our current King and Hot Wheels Racing number three. So uh, maybe this is like Jackson Storm versus Lightning McQueen, new and improved. Oh man. I love the Hot Wheels livery they put on vehicles. And there we have it, Hot Wheels Racing number one. All right, next up we have El Superfasto. Love these wheels on this one. Very sweet. 619. Booyaka, booyaka. Every time I see a luchador, I automatically think of like a Brave Mysterio. Don't judge me. Yellow Crush Car. And here we go with El Superfasto. Now this is sick, you guys. I love the red wheels with that turquoise see-through color, see-through plastic I should say. It is nice white chassis and also the turquoise here is definitely see-through. Definitely went with an X Racer's body on this. Besides the red, the red is not see-through so that is a nice touch. Man, this thing is sweet you guys. So plastic and metal, very nice. This one's definitely interesting. Cannot wait to see how he does. Oh, there he went. El Superfasto. Sorry about me sniffing a lot. My nose is just driving me crazy. We went from super hot days to 70 degree days. But anywho, next up we have Invader. Look at the back real quick. To do a bang up job. The big kaboom. Orange crush car. And now we have Invader, who also has a matte scheme. I love it. Love the matte schemes. Those are really sharp. Now I actually don't have an Invader Hot Wheel, so uh, I would like to find one. So maybe they'll do like a two pack what they're doing now with one. Alright. Looks like you got a monster truck count right here. Oh, holy moly. One, two. Yeah, this will be the guy that gets eliminated first. He's this big talker here. He eliminates monster trucks. He'll be, he'll be toast. Maybe not. There you have it. Invader. All right, now I told you we would get to my favorite dairy delivery scheme, and here it is. This is the Hot Wheels Special Forces. This thing is sick, you guys. All right. Man, this thing is... Comes with an orange crush car. All right, and here it is, Hot Wheels Special Forces. The dairy delivery matte black with embossed decaling this thing is beautiful you got the red bead locks red windows special forces right there hot wheels monster truck logo right there my god this thing is beautiful hot wheels special forces right there and this and i love the embossing on this man I think it's sick. I hope this thing wins. I want this thing to be king. No, I just can't wait to be king. Just can't wait to be king. Oh my gosh, I need to stop. I'm moving on. <laughs> All right, take a quick break and uh, get these singles. Oh, no, wait, we can't yet. We got one more. I forgot about Bigfoot. Oh my gosh. So here we have Bigfoot. Very cool. I cannot believe I almost forgot about Bigfoot. That would have been embarrassing original stomp now you guys know I do have a 124 scale Bigfoot but uh 
he definitely can't play. Red Crush Car, and we'll go ahead and look at Bigfoot here. They definitely tried to mimic the Ford body style, but <clears throat> I'm guessing they cannot for the, the Hot Wheels monster trucks. They don't, I guess they don't have the licensing for Ford for the monster trucks. I don't know. Of course, Bigfoot, I don't know what Bigfoot number this is. Bigfoot number or something. Of course, Firestone and Summit on there. That's pretty nice. Got the Bigfoot logo. Hot Wheels monster truck. Bigfoot right there on the front. I know Greenlight, I believe it's Greenlight, does a Bigfoot line as well. Like their King of Crunch line. Maybe they have the Ford licensing and Hot Wheels can't. I don't know. And then there you got Bigfoot on the tailgate. As you can see, they definitely tried to do it like a Ford tailgate. But yeah. Very awesome. All right, now I'm going to take a break, get these guys out of the way, and uh, look at the two packs. Welcome back. We are moving on to the two packs. Not Tupac, two pack. All right, up first we have Loco Punk and Pure Muscle. Again, this is not saying new for 2020, so this probably is last year's two pack. We do have the police and Hood again. We have the Dodge. Uh, Roger Dodger and the Dodge Charger and we have Hot Wheels Safari and Wild Streak so uh, that definitely wraps up that pack so we'll go ahead and <clears throat> now this one does not come with crush cars this one just comes with two trucks we'll take a look at Pure Muscle first well, well Local Punk just left now this is definitely a sweet looking truck I love the plain Jane look to it number 99 with the turquoise and white. Look at that articulation. Clear up into the fender. Oh yeah. Pure muscle there on the back. I love this one, you guys. This one's sick with the chrome beadlock. Monstrous. All right. And now we'll take a look at Loco Punk. Choo choo! Definitely a sweet looking casting. The train is nice. Oh wait, I forgot to show you the back. I oh, know I didn't. I didn't really forget, but if you guys want to read that, go ahead and pause it right now because I'm moving on now. Anywho, local punk definitely got the choo-choo train aspect. Mr. Wildest Ride in the Wilderness. If you guys know where that's from, uh, leave a comment down below. I'm curious. <laughs> local punk monster truck. Local punk five. Locomoto number five. Loco, now something. Love the brown wheels. That looks sick. Again, I love it when they do the do, when when they do matte paint colors. To me, that just pops more than gloss. Surprisingly. All right, here you have it, Loco Punk. All right, now I already have Chewbacca, but I could not find a single Darth Vader anywhere. So uh, I picked up the two packs, and so now we have two Chewbaccas. I'm done. <laughs> All right, so you got Darth Vader versus Chewbacca in the Demolition Doubles. Very cool art. Let's go ahead and look at the back there. To rule the galaxy, to protect the Rebel Alliance. Very cool. Man, I love how easy these are to open. That just makes my life easy. So, of course, we'll take a look at Chewie first, because he's better. Chewbacca is sweet looking. I love how they have his arrow, his uh, crossbow cannon right there. Got his hair all over this thing. <laughs> I'm not going to stop. Send help. Of course, I gave him stacks that look sweet. Chewbacca. Now, uh, Darth Vader. That was a cat. Boom, 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 Darth Vader definitely went with the same body style that they did for the character. I believe it was a character car. Correct me if I'm wrong. And as well as the ID car, they just jacked it up. 
So uh, definitely not one of my favorite body styles, but uh, Darth Vader is definitely beast. So uh, yeah, Darth Vader. Of course, on both Chewie and Darth Vader, you will not find a Hot Wheels monster truck logo or a Hot Wheels sign. So, uh, I mean, besides the tires, but like on the body itself, you will not find that just because of, uh, well, I'm guessing licensing issues. But yeah, Darth Vader. All right, now onto our final two pack, which I have two of, but you will not be seeing the other one because the other one will be used later on for a giveaway. And that is Spur of the Moment versus Steer Clear. <clears throat> have all of those as well. Very cool. You guys can go ahead and look at that. But yeah, like I said, I have another one of these, and I will definitely be doing a giveaway. I don't know when, but you guys seem to really like the giveaways. All right. So first up, we'll look at Spur of the Moment. Definitely got the pickup style again. Definitely got the wide earp aspect. Cowboys. Spur of the Moment. Got a rope around there. I love this. This looks nice right here. It's a nice uh, decaling there. Of course, you got the boot spur right there. I don't know if I really care for the yellow wheels, but that's just me. But yeah, spur of the moment. All right, next up you have steer clear. I got to stop making noises for all these monster trucks. <laughs> this is steer clear. Sweet looking truck. Man, this thing is sick. Oh, yeah. Again, I don't know if I really care for the blue wheels. I can see how it would, like, match where these fenders are right here. That's, again, that's just me being critical. I love how this is, like, window right here. So that's pretty nice. All right. Steer clear. Nothing too special about it. It's just... All right, next up we have, which I, I know these are new for 2020. Now these are monster trucks that come with a free Hot Wheels car. And some of them include like a crushed car for them, but they actually roll and they actually have their own names. So I cannot wait to get into that. So let's get started. All right, so let's dive into the first one. And that is another Mega Rex, but this one definitely in mechanical form. Just like Jason X, oh my gosh, watch out for this guy. But it does come with a free crushed die-cast car. Go ahead and take a look at the back here. And we do have all of them. Bone Shaker, Roger Dodger, Twin Mill, Mega Rex, VA Bomber, Demo Derby, and Tiger Shark. I cannot wait to check out these, these uh, crushed cars, you guys. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we will get to the crush car here in a minute, but let's check out the mechanical Mega Rex. The blue wheels are definitely awesome. Yeah, this thing's sweet. Now, I don't know if he's mechanical or he's like armor plated. Is there a difference? I don't know. <clears throat> the teeth graphics look really nice. I love how the teeth are actually embossed. That's sick. Yellow chassis. Ooh la la. All right. Now check out this crushed car. It actually rolls really nice. And they have their own name. This is Sudden Stop. So uh, pretty cool. You get four of those. Well, one per. Yeah, you just, you saw the back of the packaging. Sudden Stop. That's pretty cool. All right, next up, you have Roger Dodger, which does not come with a crush car, but it comes with a Roger Dodger that has the same exact paint scheme as the monster truck. So that is sick. They don't put stats on the back. That's a little upsetting, but you know, beggars can't be choosers, can they, Double HD Nation? So as always, we will take a look at the monster truck first. Roger Dodger. We actually have a Roger Dodger, but it is not this orange scheme. 
It is a blue scheme. 1968. That big old blown V8. That thing is. That thing churns some power, I bet. Of course, you got Hot Wheels there on the top. Definitely a classic style scheme they went with. I love it. Blue chassis. Roger Dodger. All right. And of course, we'll take a look at the Roger Dodger car. Like I said, it is the exact same scheme. Just in 164 scale, basic style. Very cool. All right. Next up, we have Tiger Shark. Now, Tiger Shark does come with a crush car. All right, take a gander at Tiger Shark. We do. We don't have a Tiger Shark, but we have a Leopard Shark who uh, seemed to be pretty fast. Yeah, Tiger Shark. Pretty sure Shark Week's coming up. Random thought. But yeah, here we go. Tiger Shark. Very menacing, but very sweet. All right, and then we will take a look at the Crush Car, which is. Flat iron. <laughs> I can see why it's called flat iron. Because it's, yeah, you guys get it. I love these rollable crush cars. These things are sweet. Definitely a wagon looking style. Oh no, the poor wagon. I love wagons. And it's crushed. Yeah, flat iron. Oh, kind of sticks in the track. Oh, ran into Roger Dodger. All right, up next we have Demo Derby. crush car out and we'll get demo derby out now i actually don't have a demo derby so uh that is sweet i actually really wanted this cassie but i just never bought it but i love how the tires are all like you know ready for a demolition derby hence the name you got the hot wheels flame logo right there with some smiley faces this looks like something travis pastrana created See, okay, here's here's something I kind of... See how they're like this on that side? They're like that on the other side? I kind of would have, like, reversed them. I don't know. That's just me. Number 68. What is that? What? What is that supposed to be? Yo, Hot Wheels. What? What? No. <laughs> no. That can't be unseen. Number 68. Yeah. Pretty sick. Besides the, besides that, no, no we're just gonna. Hopefully, kids aren't watching. <laughs> and of course, we move on to the crush car, which is this is speed bump. Definitely a two door coupe looking car, almost like a Buick. It's like a Buick or a Monte Carlo, but it's crushed. All right. Next up, we have the Twin Mill Twins. Aha, you see what I did there? I know, I'm hilarious. Alright, so we take a look at Twin Mill. Now, I have a gripe with Twin Mill here as well. Why paint it? Why not put a plastic windshield in like every other monster truck has? Why? Why cheap out on one of the coolest monster trucks you have made? And you just paint the damn windshield? Come on. Let's, let's, let's clean up our act here, Hot Wheels. This is... Every other monster truck over here has a clear windshield or a colored windshield of some kind. And you hurt my boy Twin Mill. Oh my gosh. I mean, at least you gave it a pretty cool graphic, I guess. I mean, all right. And of course, you have the Twin Mill car. Oh, look. Is that, look at that. Plastic windshield. Hmm. They just don't care about you, Monster Truck Twin Mill. But yeah, that Twin Mill is sick. Same paint scheme as the Monster Truck. Alright. Next up we have... B -b 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 Bone Shaker. <clears throat> ah. Now I already have this color Bone Shaker. But I don't have that color Hot Wheel Bone Shaker. So that's basically why I bought this. So again, this is just the standard bone shaker as we saw in the Monster Truck Tournament before. Plain Jane bone shaker. Pretty sweet. 
but this is why I really bought that two pack. Well, it's not really a two pack, it's a buy a monster truck, get a free Hot Wheel. This bone shaker is sick, and I love it. And I'm not even a huge bone shaker fan, but this one, this one called to me. Yeah, bone shaker. All right, and lastly, we have V8 Bomber. Now, V8 Bomber comes with a van crush flattened car th thing. That was a hiccup. <clears throat> and, of course, again, I do have a V8 Bomber as well. But I wanted to get the whole set of these to showcase to you guys. And I wanted that crushed van. Of course, V8 Bomber. Sick looking model. Hey, look at that. That's a windshield. I'm not, I'm not going to get over that, you guys. I'm actually quite upset about that. Ah. Uh. As you can see, it also does have a monster truck count. Two, four, six, eight. How many did Invader have? Two, four, six, seven. Oh, boy. I think we may have to pair these two together. See which one gets a higher body count. But yeah, V8 Bomber. All right, and lastly, we will take a look at his crushed van, which is blindsided. Blindsided. All right, definitely got the crushed van look. I dig it. Does it roll nice? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. So there you have it, Double HD Nation. We just unboxed 32 Hot Wheels trucks. So uh, why don't you go ahead and smash the like button on this video? That lets me and YouTube know you do enjoy the content and you want to see more of it. This is Hawkeye Hard Diecast, where we review, showcase Hot Wheels cars, Hot Wheels tracks, and we hold Hot Wheels competitions. So, uh, and like I said, this week is Truck Week, so uh, we got quite a bit of events. So you definitely want to make sure you're subscribed and have that bell rung so you never miss a future upload. Go ahead, drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think of these Hot Wheels monster trucks. Which one is your favorite? I am curious to know. It doesn't have to be from this lot. It can be from any of them actually so uh actually we have quite a few of them so uh now these will these ones will be the ones racing this week as we already saw the other ones race already but once this tournament is out of the way we will have a huge monster truck tournament so i uh, definitely look forward to that but guys like i said for the joy logano giveaway announcement make sure you keep checking the community tab on my page that is where you will find the rules i don't know when i'll get it published but it'll be sometime this week but with that being said you guys Hopefully you have an amazing rest of your day. Head over to my socials. All those links are down below. Go give them a follow. Go join the Discord. That link is also down below. Love chatting it up with you guys over there. It's a fun Hot Wheels community. Lots of friendly, amazing people over there. And I want to thank you guys all for joining the Discord. If you guys want to become a Patreon for as little as $3 a month, you can help support the channel for future uploads. As you guys can see in the background, I am unveiling a new track, but... All those kits and everything cost money, so uh, when I launch it, it may not be complete, but it will be eventually, so it is a work in progress. Progress. So hopefully you guys are looking forward to it. But guys, head over to my Teespring store, pick up a t-shirt if you would like to rep some Double HD merch. And if you do pick some up, let me know, tag me in your social medias, and I will give you a shout out on the channel. But with that being said, you guys, have a great rest of your day, and I will see you guys next time here at The Holler. Peace and have a monstrous day.